Welcome to I've Got the Runs. It's time for another gear review. Knox Gear sent me the 39G. Now, admittedly, I heard G's, which is why I was so eager to review this. Yes, send me giant stacks of cash. I'll let you know what I think about it. But I guess I was mistaken. There is no S at the end of that. It's the 39G. It's a wearable Bluetooth speaker. Now, they sent me this a month ago, and they're probably thinking, Chase, why haven't you done the review yet? Because Chase is my name. Chase is on. Yes, the Chase is on. That's my real name, not a pun that I made up for the show. But yeah, Knox Gear, if you're wondering why I'm just now getting to it, it's because it was in quarantine. I've got a quarantine station, so today I'm just going to take the necessary precautions and pull it out of there. With this COVID thing, you just want to be as safe as possible, so... All right. Okay. Going in. All right. Steady. Steady. We have touchdown. Okay. I'm just going to scan it. Make sure it's all right. Okay. Checking the readings here. Okay. And that looks good. All right. And in case anyone wants a face mask, I got this from Aaron Girl Sewing on Etsy. So check that out. The link's in the description. How about that? We got two reviews and one here. I haven't caught it yet, so clearly they work well. All right, so first off, the setup. I haven't opened this yet. I don't know how to connect it to anything yet, but I'm gonna do that here and let you watch because that's how reviews are done. I should time it too. All right. Okay, step one, open package. All right, let's see my form there? See that? That was easy. That took all of nine seconds. Would have been less had I shut my mouth. Okay. The box is very box-like. Smells like a box. Smells like this box. I don't know if it smells like all boxes. Boom. What's this? It says it's important. Take care not to overbend your clip. Placing the clip over a thick material could break it. But if your clip breaks, we will send it for your replacement. All right. Well, we got to test that out. Let's break this clip. Important thing number two is magnet mode. Our favorite way to wear the 39G. You can securely wear your 39G through a shirt or jacket using the magnetic clip. Simply slide it down with your thumb to remove, then place it on the inside of your clothing while placing the speaker on the other side. Did this just explain how magnets work? I'm dumb, I'm not that dumb. Okay, let's get to it. This is the 39 gram wearable Bluetooth speaker with a kick. Okay, and this, this is what I was wondering. <laughs> Where are the instructions? They're in the bottom of the box. I did get worried there for a second because I thought I was gonna have to complain that Knox Gear didn't give instructions. It blended in. It looks just like the bottom of the box. Well, not so much anymore because I opened it. But before it did, I thought it was, okay, it was my bad. Okay, so I've been goofing around. I'm gonna stop my timer. I'm gonna keep this zipped as best I can. I'm gonna go through these instructions and see how quick I can set this up. So here we go. talks to me. I didn't know that was going to happen. Okay, so the blue and red light is flashing. So much for not talking. I'm just explaining what's going on here. The blue and red light's going. That means it's in pairing mode. Connected. Okay, that was one minute and 26 seconds. And that was with me even showing you the flashing light. So apparently it's super easy to connect. And now I'm flashing blue there, which means I'm connected. So now... Okay, so today's the day. October 1st. Get the date off the screen. Get the date off the screen. That went much quicker than I thought. I definitely thought this was gonna take like 10 or 15 minutes. So what I'm gonna do now, since that was so quick, is I'm going to turn off... Yes, I'm disconnecting you. I'm gonna turn this off. Power off. You're so smart. You know everything I'm doing. And I'll just show you what I did. There's a play button here. You just press and hold. Knox Gear 39G activated. Battery good. And then you go to whatever you're using. You find the Bluetooth on it. 
Turn the Bluetooth on. And then one of the devices is Knox Gear 39G. You just click it. Connected. And we're done. So now I'm gonna test out the strength of this magnetic hold here. I wanna see just how well I can trust this thing when it's magneted to me. It's a word, right? So this little addition is mine. This is just an anchor I made. Some might call it a necklace. I'm calling it an anchor just because it feels more manly that way. Oh, look at that anchor. I just wanted something to catch this once I get it to come off my clothes. So I will be trying to knock this off my shirt. Yeah. Ugh. Ugh. One of those. Okay. Gonna be a little more work than I thought. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah. Brakes. It's good with fast stops too. I was going at least 50. I'm gonna get this. I don't know how the mic's doing with all this, but so far, the magnet is working better than I thought. Got it. All right, well, I guess Knox Gear didn't account for that. You know, that situation where you're just doing that with your shirt. I don't know how I'm supposed to run with this if I can't do that. <sighs> Seriously though, the magnet clip held really well. I would definitely trust that to run with, so good job, Knox Gear. Good job. All right, time to test this out on a run. First, the most important part of every run. Let's see if it can handle this. What's up, squirrels? Oh, scatter! Scatter, guys! All right, so just starting out the run, I can tell you this is not that noticeable. By comparison, I have a mic pack down here. Usually my phone is hooked up to the mic, but today I have to make some changes so I can get the sound going out of that. But while this thing's bouncing around, the 39G is just there. It's kind of like when you have a race bib on and you know you have something pinned to you, but it's like not that big a deal. So what are some advantages to having this wearable speaker. Well, for one, you don't have headphones in your ears. I don't like to run in headphones because you can't hear cars and stuff. So this is definitely great for safety on the run. That being said, you can still plug headphones into this. So if you need that, that's an option. Another plus is you can clip it pretty much anywhere. I'm using the magnetic clip now, but it also just has a regular clip too. So if you wanted it on a backpack, wristband, something like that, you could do it. And it gives you easy access to the play button. You can turn the volume up and down, skip through songs, and you don't even have to stop running. It charges by USB. And what I really like about the USB charger is that it says Knox gear on it. I have so many of those different USB chargers. It's nice to know what this one came from. Oh good. Resting pods. I love resting pods. Ooh, sideways resting pods. If you get a call while you're out, you just press the play button here. That picks it up. You wanna end the call? You hit play again. I don't really have to worry about that though. Because nobody calls me. No one ever calls me, guys. So as far as sound goes, I think it sounds really great. I was actually worried because I thought there's no way something this small is gonna sound good. And then what was I supposed to do? Because I'm not gonna tell you it sounds good when it doesn't. But fortunately, Knox Gear made it so I didn't have to say that. This really is a good speaker. I doubt that this mic is giving it justice, but I'd recommend it if you want one. You can go to knoxgear.com and use the code IGTRVLOG and that'll get you a discount. So with that, why don't you go ahead and play us out, 39G. Oh my. You must have had a lot of skin one day.
one more thing I will say, you don't need the volume up that loud if you're just in a quiet neighborhood and you can still hear it pretty good. But if you do get next to a busy road like I was just on, it's very easy to just crank it up. So again, I don't wear headphones, so I can't really compare it to that. But I imagine this is much better than blasting the music in your ears next to a highway. Anyway, thank you all for getting the runs with me. Thanks to Knox Gear for letting me test this out. Okay, lastly, I'm gonna do a distance test. Let's see if that Bluetooth cuts out as I run away with the phone here. Thank you all for watching. You know, I have no idea until I go back and watch the video as to whether or not this thing cuts out, but you know, we'll learn together. We'll all see it at the same time. Like the meteors that are coming later in 2020. It'll be an experience. I'm uncomfortably far away from my equipment. I'm coming back. Um, if it didn't cut out yet, there's really no need for me to be that far away from it. So, great job, Knox here. Oh, you're still going. How about that?